go. Bang, oh bang, my goodness, we are finally here. There it is, Box headquarters. How you doing? Good. Water potty, man. He's on every Let's day. Let's see if we can get in there. Please. All right, pre line check oh, in. Oh, shoot. It's like a Star Wars. Yeah, right. this is crazy. Well, and they just have a sick pit bike track, track like back here. They're gonna be doing some races on. Yeah. It's gonna be a tight fit. Yeah, you got this, no problem. No, no problem. Make it problem. Dude, dude, you got a mile on the right side. We're getting a private escort. I love it. How are we looking? I, we're looking mighty fine. Look at the look at this guy grinning. Nice. Hey. Oh. Yo, look at the track. Awesome. Dude, look at that. That looks sick. <laughs> Yo, that is tight. Signing your life away, huh? Yeah. Y'all good? Locked and loaded? Good to go. And bing bong. Find you anywhere after you are fighting. Yeah. <laughs> <I'm just kidding. laughs> yeah, no getting out of this one. <laughs> wow, so perfect. We just got here and the one, the one thing we needed on the trip. Gas. Let's get gas. gas. We get all oh, parked oh, oh, and take, everything take, take. and miss the gas station. Track looks epic. What are we thinking? It's a little tight. It is tight. It's a little tight. <laughs> yeah, so outside or inside though? Oh, dude, I'm outside killer, dude. Split, well, I don't know. table, I table, could inside could be outside. Okay. Is it racing like that with the splits? Yeah. Dude, that'll make it interesting because like you can't cut or like I mean no like going back to it. Yeah. <laughs> he will, yeah, he'll find those lines. Deep bouncing over. Yeah. <laughs> so it's like literally whatever line's faster you have to take. But uh, once you get two bikes in the same line, line, it'll be tight. Dylan, what's the fast line? Uh the middle. Like where the where these things are? Yeah, just riding on top ride of them. In the middle? And then you quad the step on step off. Okay. Yeah, step off this onto that little beam. Yeah. Right that seems kind of sketchy, but. Just like, just right here. My uh, right here, just. Right yeah. Right here, outside quad. Bad idea to wear the. Yeah, that's a pretty good little jump. Yeah. Finish line into literally, Supercross is on Saturday, so they made literally a Supercross stopper straight up and down. This is gonna get interesting for sure. Little roller. Lots of people will probably slide out here. So hopefully it's none of us. Lots of people will probably slide out here. So hopefully it's none of us. And then right over this stopper into an S turn and then back around into the sand section and wrap it back around. You ready? <laughs> you ready? Yeah. Okay. Dude, I'm biting my fingernails. I'm nervous. He's not here to lose. Uh, we're glad to have you guys. This whole team put a lot of work into this, and uh, we're glad to see you get on it and get after it. I'm Dave Mateus. You guys all probably know Jason Baker. And uh, we're going to run through a few things real quick. You guys all talk about the no, no hit zone, or we'll explain that. Um, one big thing we're talking about is the start. I gotta take Eye track arms walk arms is complete. Like I'm walking. Camera girl. Oh yeah, camera girl. Bailey's no, gonna, gonna be on the vids. Right B Wild's got his new new sock <laughs> shoes. Dude, look at what are those Uggs? They're oh, Uggs. Things, dude. Look at those. Those looks like they got the traction. You should be good on they the track. They got a lot of traction. And they're doing a Le Mans start. So basically, we're gonna start by running to our bike. So that's definitely gonna shake things up. That's gonna help Just, me. Yeah, <laughs> I don't know. Hopefully, I that all goes smooth because it's gonna be tough to make passes out on the track. Yeah. Yeah, we need to add some horsepower on the old rig. How do you plan on adding horsepower when we're already here? We ain't got black wheels. Look, that looks slow already. Yeah, it does. It really does. Does it? Hey, you got black wheels. Be wild, got black wheels. You don't got black wheels. Here, I'll spin it. Too close, too close, too close. That's way too much speed. <laughs> Faster. Oh. I got the back. Go get the nipple. Yeah. Fresh steed. Hey, you gonna gas all this up? Yeah, I can gas. Yeah. Hi. Good. I knew we brought a mechanic. There.
there he is. A few wilds on my old bike, you wanna make it look good? Absolutely. You got a frame, that's, that's good power right there. Kyson's bike, we all had to choose a new number, so Kyson's 44, B-Wild's 31, huh? And I'm the lucky number 13. Tell you what, it's already full, I'm just kidding. It's already full. Oh, it is? <laughs> Transponders and everything, this is gonna be epic. Wow, starting off great. Kyson got a flat tire. I already went through a shock. Doing a little mechanic in. Out with the old. Luckily we brought the parts bike. <laughs> We're doing mechanic stuff, dude. Oh, uh, I don't do that. <laughs> yeah. yeah, we know that. Oh, P-Wild's already on a different bike, too. <laughs> yeah, P-Wild started on my bike. And now, look at this poor thing. Alright, P-Wild's already got a engine light that's flashing. Two. Oh, no, that means, hey, that means check engine. The engine is there. The engine is I forgot gas. <laughs> I forgot gas. Um, front brake didn't work on this one. Front didn't want to run. On yeah, front now brake. the front brake's not working on that one. You blew a shot and then you blew a wheel. That's your tip, baby. This got your little hammer now. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> There it goes. This is B Wild's bike for the day. My bike somehow still surviving. Painted the wheels though. Looks sick. I right, should back up and run. Hey, your bike's ready. That's nice. In the pit bike race, Ricky, what are we calling the pit bike race? What's the official title? Backyard Invitational Pit Bike Race, right? I mean, the biggest prize purse pit bike race on the face of the planet. Is that maybe? I mean, ten grand's pretty pretty sporty, right? We got some cheddar to give away. I'm was this a was it. this a winner take all? Yeah. Yeah. Huh? <laughs> give the man winner money take all. Out loud. All right, ten thousand bucks. What would you do? Well, there's some brothers here, and you had a plan. Remember, you were saying what the plan would be. Yeah. If if anybody were, my well, age has ever brothers, watched Happy Days, so there, there was you know two, about the Malachi brothers, brothers, right? There's two brothers here, racing, and and you had a strategy for them. Like they needed to line up on both sides. They got to take make a stank a dog out. Sandwich on stank dog. Well, guess what? They didn't even really need to do that. See, and uh, you know, being brothers. Probably gonna be a long ride home for one of the, one of the brothers. Shit. However, Shit. our man Caden Palmer bringing home the back box backyard. Thousand dollars. Grand, look at you, man. Look yeah. Round of applause for the fox, dude. I got to tell you, invitational. That was an absolutely epic ride. You were just following, 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 like. 
I want. I, I think I know what your plan was, but tell us what your plan was. Yeah, I mean, I got off to a decent start, and like I just was right behind him. I knew I was just like gonna run him the whole moto, go the whole 15 laps, and like as we kept going, I felt like okay, I gotta make a move at some time. Like something's gotta happen, and then two laps to go, I just I think I got enough pressure on him that he slipped it out, almost took me with him, but I was able to uh, take home the white and then go all the way to the checkered, so super stoked on it. So I gotta ask you, like I, I thought for sure you're gonna wait till the last lap and then take him out in the final turn. Was that the plan? Oh yeah, I mean you have to, I mean there's $10,000 on one. Like the last corner where he wrecked was where the last lap I was going to go on the inside and try at least, you have to try. <laughs> other, I mean other, at that point, if you're, if you're still second, there's no other choice. So other other than the ten grand probably being the coolest part of the night, what was what was so epic about this event here tonight? Honestly, the money's cool, but I mean the event's the coolest thing. I mean this is insane that Fox put this on. It's been the coolest experience. We host uh, some pit bike races in Utah, so like this is just next level, and I was just stoked we were able to be a part of it. That's fantastic. Well, Caden, congratulations! Look at that ten grand. Let's go. The feature Give him a round of applause. Fantastic job. Can buy a lot of gas on the way back to Utah right there. That's way right. to go.